Hey guys, TTM Mike coming at you with today's TTM returns. Uh, and I also sent some uh, 8x10s to be certified by JSA. So I'll do, I'm doing a video on that too. So first return here is coming back from former uh, Expos manager. He also managed the California Angels and the Milwaukee Brewers. He played eight years, I believe, maybe nine. I think it was eight years for the uh, California Angels and the Los Angeles Angels. Mr. Buck Rogers. Buck Rogers is 83 years old. So uh, if you have any cards you want to send to him, I suggest sending them out to him soon because he is not getting any younger. Mr. Buck Rogers, he was a good manager. He managed some good teams, good Expos teams. So glad to get this one back. So this was a two of two success. I also received this one back mr buck rogers i guess he wore number two so thank you mr buck rogers then uh some of you guys have seen this before i have sent this uh hall of fame eight by ten out so uh, i'll just give you a recap on who signed it there's chris hamburger he was a linebacker for the washington redskins he is a hall of famer of course charlie trippy he's a hall of famer lenny moore the running back for the baltimore colts uh Hall of Famer, uh, Jackie Smith, Hall of Famer. He was the uh, a tight end for the St. Louis Cardinals, and then uh, he was traded to the Dallas Cowboys. And he is unfortunately forever known as the tight end that dropped the wide open uh, touchdown in the end zone. And then you have uh, Elvin Bethea. So Elvin Bethea, uh, that was a fee. I think that was ten bucks. And uh, here's uh, Lawrence Taylor. He was free through the mail. Jackie Smith was free through the mail. Chris Hamburger was free through the mail. Charlie Trippy was free, free TTM. Lenny Moore was 10 bucks. And today's return comes back from Mr. DeMonte Dawson, number 63. So I paid 10 bucks to Mr. Dawson. And then when he sent my package back, he included this uh, piece of cardboard. And he wrote a little message here. He said, uh, so your picture is not bent. Take care, DeMonte. So I have no idea what I'm going to do with this. But I'll save it. Maybe I'll just cut it up. So, uh, yeah. So that's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven Hall of Famers on my Hall of Fame 8x10 project. I'm running out of room, so maybe I'll send it out one or two. Two more times, not too many more times. And Mr. DeMonte Dawson also returned my pen. So that's cool. Former offensive lineman DeMonte Dawson. So pretty cool. Uh, this took about a month. Usually Mr. Dawson signs really quick in about 10 days. So I was starting to get nervous, man. So uh, I always hold my breath and hope for the best when I send these projects out. And I'll be honest with you, some of them have never come back. I had a uh, 8 by 10 with a couple of Puerto Rican uh, baseball players on it that I took the photo in Puerto Rico myself, and that never came back. So, And I had about eight guys on there. So always hold your breath. There's always a chance. I mean, if you don't want to risk having a broken heart when you send out these uh, requests, then don't send them out. So I like to gamble, man. So I'm going to take maybe another chance, maybe two more times. So uh, I'm thinking about sending out to... Former Kansas City Chief Leroy Kelly. We'll see what I do. I don't know. Not sure yet. But thank you, Mr. DeMonte Dawson. And next are some pictures that I sent out to be authenticated. So this first one is... is uh, I also like collecting autographs from celebrities. I don't do it as often as I do the sports uh, players. But uh, once in a while, I'll venture out and get someone. So this autograph, you can't see it that well. It was signed to Mike. Stay human. Chandler Riggs. Chandler Riggs was a little boy on uh, The Walking Dead. If you're familiar with the show, he was Rick Grimes' son, Carl Grimes, or as uh, Rick would call him, Coral. So he signed my photo, and then I sent it to JSA, and it was authenticated right there, JSA. Uh, this next guy is uh, Jeff Corber. Jeff Corber played Claimer Joe. Uh, he was a rogue band of, you know, in the apocalypse. He had his little crew in the cop in the apocalypse. That's him right there. You've seen him in a lot of stuff. He was in a uh, Sons of uh, Sons of Anarchy, I believe. He's been in a whole bunch of stuff. Jeff Corber, great actor, but uh, he was the leader of the Claimers. They used to call him Claimer Joe, 
And um, he was only on about four or five episodes of The Walking Dead. And uh, he actually got killed by Rick when he attempted to harm Rick's girlfriend and let his crew rape Rick's son. So nothing funny about that, but that's what drove Rick over the edge. Rick bit Claimer Joe in the neck and just ripped his neck apart. But uh, great show. I love The Walking Dead. So anyway, when I wrote to Jeff Corb, I asked him if he could write down this, this inscription. So this inscription was something he actually said to another one of the characters, uh, uh, Norman Reedus, Daryl. He told he tells Daryl, ain't nothing sadder than an outdoor cat that thinks he's an indoor cat. And then he signed it, Joe. Peace, Jeff Corber. So I send this to him. Uh, he lives in California. I send it out through the mail. And it came back authentic. So very happy to get this. He is, uh, if you can see his, I don't know if you can tell from his face, but he's uh, uh, one of these well-known character actors. He's never been like a superstar, but he's been in a lot of stuff, Jeff Corber. So, happy to add Mr. Corber's autograph to my collection. There it is, Jeff Corber. And glad it's a real autograph. Because, you know, sometimes you send these photos out and they're secretarials. Or uh, signed by the wife or the husband. So, two of two right there. And then this guy right here, that's Mr. Wes Craven. That's right, the director of Nightmare on Elf Elm Street and other movies. So he signed it to Mike Wes Craven. So uh, I didn't know if this was real or not. You know, you never know. But I printed this picture off uh, the internet. Send it to Walgreens. Walgreens, uh, no, no, no. I sent those pictures. I had those pictures printed off the internet. This one, uh, I sent him something else. I sent him a cover of a DVD, a DVD cover. He signed that and he included this 8x10 with my mail, he just sent sent out his own uh, envelope, and uh, he's passed away, unfortunately, Wes Craven. But uh, very happy to add the great director Wes Craven to my collection. So glad that was real. Super, super glad that was real. And there goes the JSA sticker. And last but not least, I also wrote to this guy, and you all recognize him. That's Kane Hodder. He played Jason. In the Jason horror movies. So I printed this photo off the internet. And uh, had it sent to Walgreens. And I picked it up at Walgreens. And I sent it out to him. So there it is. He signed it. Kane Hodder. Jason. And this one was also authentic. It was authenticated by um, JSA. Did I say PSA before? No. It was authenticated by JSA. So... That was cool. That I mean, you never know who's going to fake them, who's going to have secretaries or, you know, people sign for them. So I'm very happy that these, all four of these were authentic. And then JSA sends you these little certificates letting you know uh, that your autographs are real. So that is it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this quick video. I love these autographs. I'm glad. That I'm so happy that they're authentic. So I sent this with William Tolentino. He has a Facebook group where he sends your uh, autographs. Uh, well, I, I believe he has a store in Maryland, and he has JSA come to his store, and there they authenticate sports autographs, celebrity autographs, music autographs, stuff like that. So thank you, William Tolentino. Don't know if you're going to watch this video, but thank you anyway if you do uh, happen to watch. And um, thank you to Mr. DeMonte Dawson and to the great... Buck Rogers, no, not the space, the space uh, astronaut and uh, Buck Rogers, but Buck Rogers, the baseball player, baseball coach. And thanks to you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed this quick video and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Please hit that like button, subscribe and uh, have a great weekend. I'll catch you all next time. Something ends up in my mailbox. Take care, guys. God bless. Peace.